Hybrids, fairway woods. These things can get us out of trouble, can't they? But they can also be an absolute menace. Hi everybody, I'm Alex, I'm a PJ Gold professional and this channel is powered by you, the viewers. Yes, you. So if there's anything that you're worried about in your golf game, get down in those comments. Make sure you subscribe, hit that bell because you wouldn't want to miss your request. So, today's requests come from number one, Owen Greller. Alex, I'm topping a fairway wood and the ball ends up a foot behind me. Or behind you. Oof, that is a, that is a bad top. We're going to sort it out, don't worry. And Shane Jones. For me, hybrids are hook machines. Why I don't carry them, I'm considering perhaps a lower lofted one, like a two iron kind of thing or somewhere around 18, 19 degrees. Do you have any tips to stop hooking hybrids? Okay, let's just get you striking hybrids. Let's get you striking fairway woods with this simple drill. So the hybrids and fairway woods that I carry, I have a 17 and a half degree rad speed and a 19 degree rescue three. And I sort of, well, I carry them both, but I chop and change out with a three iron and this three hybrid depending on the conditions. Now, what we're gonna say applies exactly the same, no matter if I'm carrying my five wood or my hybrid. This drill works for both. So, when you're topping or when you're hooking or when you're not striking these hybrids or fairway woods good, we're stood here, maybe one, not with the correct ball position, but two, trying to get it in the air. I tend to see this motion come most commonly. And any time we have this motion, we then start to hit two up on the golf ball, but then also our club face is more likely to be very, very close. So we're gonna change that concept. Look at this down here, right? You can see here, let's sort of give you that example. Imagine your golf club is running along this alignment stick. If you get behind the golf ball, lean back, you start to work up too quickly, you can see how you would catch that ball sort of halfway up it. Not a good strike. Okay, if we change that, we hit down on it or have that concept of not hitting as up on it, we can then brush that ground a bit better where we contact the ball and therefore we are more likely to get the back of the golf ball. Right, for this drill, it, it literally couldn't be any simpler all you're gonna need, <laughs> all you need is a box of golf balls. Right, we've got a box of golf balls now, and uh, what's your alignment stick, Alex? Uh, all you're gonna need is to pop this down. Now the placement is vital. So watch this, so I placed it down, and the back golf ball in this box is aligned onto the golf ball that I'm about to hit. You don't have to put it so close, but you, you, you could put your club quite close to it. I'm sort of leaving maybe two fingertips in between the box of balls and the club head. And all I want you to do is just address the golf ball, ball position, a club head inside your left heel, and just have a few practice swings, not contacting the ground here, but having that idea of brushing and bruising that ground from the start of the box to the end of the box. Just like this. Start small to begin with. This is what I'd suggest really. Start small, go a bit longer, go a bit longer again, and then until you, feel comfortable that you can consistently bottom out as you're striking the golf ball, if not just in front. And then you're gonna take your strike from topped, horrible, hooky, disgusting, to a much more superior strike. And as I said at the start, this would be exactly the same as if you had your five wood in your hand. And I would definitely recommend this straight away for 99% of golfers, Either if your three wood is adjustable, loft it up, so we've got something a bit more with some loft on it, or if you're thinking of getting a new one, go with something with a little bit more loft, like a five wood around 17 and a half degrees. You will thank me later for that one. You will thank me later. Let's sit this away. All right, let's sit both away here. But before that, what do you think about the Tiger accepting this money, you know, the social media money for the PJ Tour? It's around like eight or nine million. Should he accept it? And did you see his tweet that he put to Phil Mickelson? Oops, sorry, what do you think? Okay, so we're gonna hit both away. This is the hybrid first. Again, all your concept is striking through the box. Oh, that strike felt so good. Okay, let's now hit with the five wood. And I said this at the start, but I would really recommend a five wood. Really recommend, it's a lot easier a lot more loft, a lot more inviting, and you actually launch it a bit higher and you'll probably hit it a little further. 
There we go. Oh, get in the hole. Get in the hole. Whew. Thanks so much for watching, guys. There's some simple tips to start striking your longer clubs better.